Right, hello everybody, my name is Shretex and welcome back to Bandlord and our Eagle Rising Let's Play. And of course, what we're doing is killing some Romans. Oh, apart from that guy, that guy's dead. Now, uh, I'm actually in the middle of Italy already. We've managed to seep into their cracks. We've already captured the place that is to be Venice. And we're going to go even further into their territory today. Though it looks like my Cow's Coal Cavalry units suck. They just got wiped out all of a sudden. Not a good start for my friends there. Now, uh, we are fighting a kind of smallish guy. He's got like a hundred troops, but I'm pretty much near there as myself as well. Oh, stay back, sir. Inventory! Engage! Now, I can't actually remember how good my inventory is at this point. Hopefully, they can stand up against the legions. Although, it looks like most of these guys are kind of just auxiliaries, so we should be okay. Let me join my friends. <gasps> I forgot I have this giant axe. I got it from joining a kingdom, so we're going to see if it works. It doesn't work. Okay, now we've discovered this. Let's go back to thrusting. <laughs> That's better. Okay, I don't know how powerful this is going to be, because luckily for me, I've got a lot of noble infantry, right? So in theory, we should be on par with these Romans, or at least kind of there. Stay back! That guy's like, ah, oh, screw this, I'm leaving. <laughs> Why then? Oh, there doesn't seem to be that many of them fighting for some reason. Well, that's good for me. We can just uh, use our superior numbers in the battlefield here. I feel kind of bad for these uh, Romans. They didn't really know what they're doing. Oh. Wait, that's the flag bearer? Why is your flag so small? Well, I'm trying to press E, but it's not working. E! <laughs> there you go. <laughs> it only took five attempts to press E there. I mean, compared to my flag, it's a bit of a different story, right? Mine is truly glorious in all its splendor. Okay, how's it looking? Uh, the cavalry is doing its bits over there. What we're going to do, because this battle's taking a bit of time, we're going to split the formation. Other squad, move out, move out. We're going to do a flank. If the AI wants to work this way, I'll move around it and attack from the side. Why is this guy here? Kill him, man. Okay, we can go from the back. Okay, this should open up a bigger front at the back here. So that should work out in our favor. Perfect. i got to try and like maybe have multiple infantry commanders. So we have like two squads or maybe three. Let's see how things go. For now, though, the enemies are pretty much surrounded. There's still a few of them fighting, though. I kind of wish they learned how to fight in, like, a tight formation. That'd be really cool. Have the proper Shield War Doom. That'd be pretty epic. Just hit him, guys. There you go. They're falling apart. I say all this, though. We're technically not doing too well. It's kind of equal numbers at the moment. So we've got to try and kill some more Romans. Ooh, that guy looks important. Wait, why does this guy look different than everyone else? Pilus Prior. <laughs> is he a throwing specialist? I guess he might be. Oh, wow, I'm getting loads of kills of these pole arms right now. Why, hello there. Oh, that guy was not... Oh, Centurion! Oh, no! I don't think they really get a morale debuff from that, but it makes me feel better. Ah, excuse me, sir. I like how my arm is so high, even these... Uh, <laughs> gladiators aren't really piercing me up much these days. I think I'm carrying like 160 armor or something stupid. It's insane. I think they broke through the first formation here. We're getting there though, near there. I do not think my carry did a very good job. I think they got absolutely wrecked. We can't be too surprised though. They're currently fighting what my guys are like cavalry. They got like a shirt and maybe like a headband or something. Well, the Roman cavalry is uh, <clears throat> slightly more powerful. Good job, everyone. Is that the enemy leader over there? No, he's been knocked down. Good. That's what we want to see. Yeah, it's a tough battle. I mean, if you're playing base game with, like, outfighting Romans, this would have been, like, a 100% victory of, like, five losses. So, it, they are definitely strong. Oh, horse. Not equipped to... Damn it, game. <laughs> I still haven't got any riding skills. I might have to put a focus point in it just so I can ride horses, because it's getting a bit ridiculous. Okay. We've done it. Beautiful. So I actually changed uh, between episodes my two games, which I kept forgetting to modify for like three episodes in a row. It's done now, everybody. It's all sorted out. Uh, you are free to go. I'm still trying to level up. So <laughs> when that's finished, we can start killing them all. Yeah, so we now have, uh, we'll show you in a second. We've got Monk and we've also got Nalgus the Beefy. Oh, a legendary Gladius. Wait, I've already got one. This one's better though. Ooh. It is better. Okay, I'm going to take it with me. This is my new main weapon of doom. Okay, who in my formation does not have a gladius right now? Because everyone needs one. It is the met meta weapon of the game. Uh, no. 
Ah! Now goes the beefy. You are not equipped with the meta weapon. There you go, my friend. Let it. It's, it's so powerful. It actually hovers in the air. It's like a magical artifact. It's pretty awesome. Okay, so we have smashed that out. Wait, are all these ones better? Interesting. We'll leave it for now. We'll just take stuff for free. Done. Okay, so we're currently in the middle of. Well, not middle. We're nearly in Romesk. My allies have for some reason decided to siege down uh, Naples, but I'm not really sure why, because it's like really far away from the front line. <laughs> I don't know. That's a bit strange if you ask me. Uh, I'm going to pull back though, because of course we have lost some troops here. I need to make sure we're at full fighting prowess at all times here. So yeah, if I go quickly get some more skills and stuff. Uh, yes, infantry movement speed. That's going to be pretty handy. We're also grab pipe size limit. Okay, as for my new guys, we have, I said, now it's the beefy. Now, I set both of these people up to be future party leaders, okay? So that's why they're been done this way. So I did say, I did do what I said I was going to do. I have taken away attributes from these and put them onto these. Though I can't reset as level. So I kind of just cheated and gave myself more focus points because I, I can't figure out how to delete these. I don't think that's possible. So <laughs> we had to kind of make do with the, the mod that I'm using here. So yeah, so now he's going to be, in theory, a very powerful party leader at some point in the future. And that is also the same for Monk as well, who has the same setup pretty much. I mostly focus on intelligence and spirit at the start with medicine because uh, they're going to be a lot easier to level up. Now, he's already out and about though, isn't he? He's, uh, where, actually, where is he? Monk? <laughs> where are you? Lesson for, I don't know where he is. He must be like in a city or something if I can't see him on the main map. But I'm not really certain here. Okay, let's keep going this way though. We've got to go and get some more troops and stuff. Now, it's kind of strange where my guys are gone. But if we're taking over enemy territory, that's all we really need to know, know right? If we kill them all, then we win. <laughs> Simple as that. Though, of course, we did discover that there's like five rooms. There's a room here. There's a room there. And there's a room over here. Also, there's also the Byzantine Empire. So, there's quite a few rooms. Wait a second. Is this room? Is this a sixth room? No, I don't think that is the case. I thought that was a dragon for a second. It's like uh, the Targaryens have arrived and are just messing around with us. So who, who's this faction? Oh, oh my god. This guy looks like a, like a Calvin Klein model or something. It's the guy from the Old Spice advert. <laughs> that looks badass. Okay. And every day I, re I remember it. I'm not blessed like they are. <laughs> Damn it. Okay. We oh, these legionaries. We are not interested. It is interesting that they're culture. I reckon the culture does switch when you take over territory. Never Romani. It's weird that it says it's culture Romani, right? But then there's a random guy of my faction over there. It's very confusing. <laughs> I'm not really sure what's going on. You're all coming with me. Apart from the archers. Well, I just realized my party limit is 180. Is that from my shenanigans last episode with these new ranks? It must have been. Yeah, it's a bit ridiculous. Okay, give me some time, everybody. We're going to run around and get some more troop. The Dacian mercenaries have left our faction. That's a bit annoying. I like how quick it is to recruit troops here. I, every time I go to a town, because I think everyone's gone into Italy, it's just massive amounts of recruiting. <laughs> it's like... <gasps> wait, 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 wait. You got captured by a caravan? How'd you do that? Oh, I found someone. Okay, let's kill them on the way over. Oh, they can escape. Never mind. There's probably going to be a lot of lords in this part of the map, right? Though, I think I'm a bit concerned about is the war exhaustion is about to end. <laughs> We've got 96%. So if I kill this guy's here, it'll probably end the war in like five seconds. Hey, friend. I don't know what happened there. That was a bit weird. But um, <laughs> it seems to be that I can't talk to the guards. This is probably good as well because it means there's going to be less garrisons inside cities because they're going to be the outside instead. Ready up. Okay. I reckon we can just win with the cavalry, to be honest. Oh, they're, they're not that sh Let's see what happens. Go in, everybody. So, of course, most of my army at this point is going to be peasants again, because I just recruited like a hundred people. So, they're not going to be too powerful, but we do have a lot of friends on horses. I'm trying to see where they are. Oh, I forgot to get rid of this axe. Ah, oh, damn it. Oh, we'll get rid of it next time. Hey, buddy. <laughs> I thought I was going to try and knock him off his horse. Okay, let's see if we can actually kill someone with this axe on horseback. Hey, buddy. <laughs> That's so stupid. <laughs> Damn it. We will destroy them all. Slowly. Meticulously. Oh, God. Wait. Let's talk about this. What if I, like, hit their arm or something? I think that is the arm hit. Wait. Screw this. I'm getting off my horse. This giant axe will kill someone, even if it kills me in the process. Uh-oh. 
Let's talk about this, buddy. My LARPing weapon will destroy you. Oh, okay. I seem to have got a fan club. Can someone give me some resistance here, friends? I got, like, random guys just running into the enemy behind me, which has kind of saved me some trouble here. That guy's injured. We can get a kill with this axe. It's possible. We can do it. No. No. Not like this. Run. We have to get... Dude, cover me. Cover me. Our mission to get a kill with an axe will happen today. I can't thrust with an axe, unfortunately. Can I? No, I can't. Okay, we have to find another way of killing someone. So where's the guy I was hitting a second ago? It was... That guy? Yeah, he's got blood. It's him. He's the one we can kill. No! That was my only chance of killing someone. <gasps> I did it. I dismembered him as well, apparently. What, what, what fell off? I didn't even notice. Okay, now we've determined that axes can, in fact, kill. We can move on with our lives. Okay, let's get my old weapon. Where's my real weapon? There it is. Come back. Well, while I was messing around with my axe, it does seem that we have completely won this battle. Though the enemy was quite small, so I'm not too surprised there. Nice. Oh, pretty well. Ooh. No, 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 no. We're not doing that. We are not doing that. We only want non-Romans in our army, of course. Oh, they're tempting me with their super armors, but no, I refuse to become one of them. So that worked out pretty well. I'm going to keep moving towards the objective, though, and we'll see if we can get there soon. It's kind of weird I have to do a drive-by on Rome to even get to my location here. Hopefully we won't get killed too badly. There's no one inside. Good, good, good. I'm always worried about someone just pop... Oh, no. Wait, wait, wait. No, 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 no. Not my, not my city. Well, I'm pretty certain that city is doomed. How big is the garrison? 121. Okay, well. Oh, what's this? The war wants to end with Rome. And we get paid 650 grand? Oh my god, yes. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Thanks for the money in the city. We'll talk to you guys a bit later, okay? Good luck out there. It's still a bit weird that the battles and potency mod is literally just like, I refuse the tutorial. I literally like, um, like a month and it's like, oh, we've done too much fighting. <laughs> we give up now, it's fine. Okay, uh, remove prisoners. And also, where's the garrison -y thing? Should be around here somewhere. Garrison. Not this. Oh, I heard that they've changed these. This is part of the, what mod was it? I think it's part of the actual Eagle Rising mod. They've changed all the daily defaults, so they do different things now. Uh, but currently my loyalty is in the toilet, everybody. It's not looking good for us. We probably want to try and get like a Roman governor, but I'm not sure that's a good idea either, to be honest. So I guess the really only way of fixing this is we need to try and get my country to pass laws. Because otherwise they're just going to lose this city. It's already got a risk of rebellion. Um, because normally I would do... Where is it? This one. But it doesn't seem to work with this mod set. It just says zero. <laughs> so, hmm. That's not good. There's no way of me fixing my problems here. Maybe it's not working properly. I, I, I'm i not sure what's going on here. But um, yeah, normally this would at least mean your settlement won't immediately rebel every time you capture one in a foreign culture. But as we don't seem to be able to use it, I'm pretty sure that we're going to lose this city without me being able to do anything about it. I guess, what we can, what can we do about this? What can we do to fix this problem, everybody? Um, security, I really have no idea. I guess the only real way is just the laws. Well, I've only got 76 influence. It's not really going to work out for me. Well, I tried, everybody. That, that place is doomed. Don't worry about it. <laughs> it's not going to make it. Okay, so I've been messing around a little bit, everybody. I've done a template. So we're using the uh, Britain Super Cavalry. And we're also using our super infantry for the garrison. So I think daily wage. Oh my god. <laughs> what am I doing? Save current template as garrison. Yes. So that should work out hopefully. Now I don't know. I've put it on recruit from template. But so people know. If you press this off you can actually say who it recruits from. It's pretty awesome. I can be like oh buddy go and recruit from... The Russ or something. It's pretty cool. I like it. Anyway, yeah, recruit from template. So over time, this should in theory go and do its own thing. Now, I must admit, also... Oh, what's this? Allows it to do automatically. Oh, my God. That's amazing. So I'm not sure if it physically has to go off now and go to Britain 
or Germany to get the troops. I really am not sure on that one, but we'll see what happens. It might work out that way. Uh, as for guards, I don't know if I really want to do this. Create guards to defend villages. I guess we could do that. Yeah, let's just press all these buttons. Oh, I want a big stack of doom. <laughs> Oh wait, can you just do this? Oh my god, can you imagine you're walking around and some dude just shows up with like 540 guards? That's insane. Done. And out of grey return for it. Oh, there's so many options in this. And I'll buy horses. Okay, we'll let the game just do its own thing now, but we have successfully set up what we need to do. We do unfortunately have a bunch of, um, well, non... We have Romans in our camp, which is unacceptable, everybody. Completely unacceptable. So we might just take them out and just... Do something. To, I don't know what we're going to do to them. But do something. Because we have... Where are they? These people. Nope. Nope. Actually, that wasn't that bad. There was only a, a few infiltrating spy Romans inside our formation there. So we can just delete them in our party. And we should be good to go. So, unfortunately, that doesn't mean that we're no longer at war with anybody. Which is a bit sad because uh, I like war. What can I say? So, we're going to have a look around. See who we want to attack next as a nation. So, as for us, we're already getting paid a ton of money, by the way. How If I end the day, how much money do I get paid daily? Oh. Who? Hatfian. The Venetians are rebelling. Unacceptable. We must go and destroy them. Okay, I've been sieging down for a while. I feel like we're about to break one of the walls. I'm just going to wait until the morning. Break this. Okay, it's down. Break, kill the catapults. Kill that one as well. Gu guys, guys. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, it's time. We're going to go in, I think. I could technically break down both walls, but I'm not sure if that's going to be too useful. Also, while I was waiting, because it took ages to get the cat tra uh, trebuchets working, the elder garrison died from starvation, which is not very good for them, but it's great for me. So we're going to see if we can attack these guys. Because what I'll probably try and do, if I get to a point where I'm strong enough, I might create my own kingdom this time, because uh, I want to mess around with all the settings on the pipe management, so I can have a kingdom of just a noble troop or something. It's going to be ridiculous. Uh, oh, i got so many different things here. Okay, get rid of that, get rid of that. Oh, we have archers? I don't want archers. We only got nine of them, though, so it's not that bad. Who are all these people? 51. Who's got the best buff possible? It has to be you. Congratulations. Uh, I guess you go and deal with that. <laughs> You'll be fine. Okay. So I have actually got a ram as well, so we can attack from multiple directions if you want to. But for now, I'm going to try and just go through the main entrance, I think. Everyone, follow me! After me! So they have 65 dudes. Yeah, that's not that bad. We can definitely break our way in here. Oh, what the hell? Are they firing grape shots at the enemy? I don't know, that wasn't a normal attack, was it? Wait, let's wait until they fire again. Wow, they changed over to grape shot! Awesome! <laughs> I love it. Okay. Where's the enemy at? Why, hello there. Infantry, hurry up! We must charge the breach. Kill them all! Uh oh, awkward. Let's talk about this. I'm trying to land a hit on you first. Wait, let me kill you, son. There you go. Let it happen. Embrace the death. Yeah. Guys, stop. Oh my god, look at all the throwing weapons! <laughs> Wow! Did we kill anyone with that? Yes, we did! We got one guy! That's all we need to know. Men, charge! We're going in! Oh, they got throwing weapons as well. Actually, that doesn't really hurt you apart from the uh, shield. Oh, that guy's alive! Uh oh. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna go around the corner and kill your, all your. Oh. No, 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 no. I've killed myself. I'm dead. This is over for me. There's no way I'm surviving this situation. Well, that didn't go very well. It's okay. I literally move at one mile per hour like a turtle. Oh no, AI control! Well, they should be okay, right? I mean, it's, they, it's literally just attack. Once they break the gate open, it'll be fine. No? Guys? There you go. That's what I want to see. <laughs> That's a chaotic battle right here. Let's do, let's do some cinematic shots with the uh, Romans trying to hold us off here. Shank him, men! Ah, oh, there's no chance they have here. The Romans are being killed one by one. There will be no survivors. Only death. Well, that's my guy. That's not good. Why are you going up the ladder, man? Go through the main gate. 
I like how these four guys are holding off the entire formation of friends here. They actually break, break walking through. Oh, we lost a lot of dudes there. In relation to what you would normally expect. Okay, we... Well, oh! Skin <laughs> him! Ah, oh, he didn't even look. He just got attacked from behind. The last Roman. <laughs> or the last two, like, I'll hold him off, Steve! You shoot them! Oh no. Oh, what happened to what happened to him? Wait, no one cares? Imagine being this man right now. Oh! Oh no! He's dead. He didn't make it. Oh, we just rescued some random troops. Interesting. I'll take those. Not the Romans, though. Not the Romans. Cool, we've got a bunch of levels as well. I'll take all that. So I have now single-handedly destroyed an entire nation by myself, which is pretty awesome. Uh, though someone can argue that there was only like five guys in there, but still. Uh, I'm going to take this banner for myself. The Banner of Fury. Yes. Devastate the Romans. Leave none of them alive. Oh, I've lost my merciful tree. <laughs> I would like to clean this thief, yes. I'm gonna take all of Rome and turn it into a... Uh... Okay, so did I actually make a profit on that? I did! I made a profit with the amount of uh, influence I spent, which is pretty handy. Though we still have not got enough, unfortunately, to pass any laws, which we really need to do, because uh, without laws, we're kind of doomed, everybody. We are kind of doomed. Like I said, I can't keep hold of these territories, it's just not gonna work. Uh, how about this one? Loyalty, okay, so technically, it still says zero. How does this work? I might look it up. <laughs> I'm so confused. <laughs> is it a thing where I pay money and then stuff goes into it? No, it just doesn't. Completion. Why is there a completion for it? I have so many questions. Anyway, so what I can do, um, if I go back to the improved garrison thing, my Bob, it actually has the same stuff. Well, I can go back to... My other city, copy to all towns, and then Bob's your uncle, everybody. My new city has the same setup. How cool is this? I haven't got to do anything. It just works automatically. I love it. So that's all sorted out now, which is pretty good to see. Now, the question is, what do we do now? If I go and look at the Kingdom tab, who can we fight? Oh, we can declare war. Why can't we fight this guy? Cannot declare war. Le oh, they're friends. Friend. I shall have a friend. But here we are. So I reckon what we do, we should expand somewhere. I don't want to go to Sweden, no. I reckon we go for the Dacians. Because then we can attack Byzantium as well. So I'm going to use the magic of modding to declare war on our foes. Done. It should be interesting because, of course, there is going to be a cooldown now for us fighting the Imperium Romanum and also the Province of Gaul as well. So we can't really fight either of them right now. But it's okay, we can go this way instead. So hopefully, if I go over this way, we can try and find some enemies. How is my... Wait, what's happening here? Oh, I forgot about the prisoners, everybody. I have like 100 prisoners. No, they're going to disappear. But actually, it seems to stop dropping down. Normally, they just abandon like everyone just leaves at the same time. Done. Who's this guy? What's up with the weird face paint, my friend? <laughs> What's going on? We don't know. We'll even be. Ah, wait, is that their leader? No, it's not. But he looks like he's pretty strong. I want to go and fight him. Oh, the guard parties are huge. Perfect. That's exactly what I wanted. Okay, I'm going to go for that battle in a second. I just going to quickly check my level ups and stuff. Uh, ooh. Let's go for party leader skill, because you probably need that. That's pretty a pretty cool skill there. So, uh, people have started leveling up, which is good. Uh, of course, we're not at clan rank 3 yet, so we can't get more than one party. But at least people are starting to get better, right? They're starting to learn the tricks of the trade to become more powerful as time goes on here. Scarlet, what have you done? You get movement speed. It's perfect. Done. Okay. Let's go for it. Halt there. Who are you? I am no, no, Romacus Killicus. Your doom and destruction. It's time to die. Oh, it's loaded, everybody. Okay, wait. I have an archer. I don't want an archer. Get out of there, man. Get out of it. Okay. The enemy has arrived. What kind of nation do they have? They got... Wait. 
85 cavalry. Oh my god, that's a lot of cavalry. Oh Everyone, move, 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 follow me. If we hold the bridge, their numbers mean not. We will defend it with our lives. Infantry! Although I can't tell them to go there because of the weird mechanics they had ages ago. No, let me get a formation on the bridge. There you go, perfect. They're coming. A lot of them are coming. Oh my god. Um, actually, do you know what? It's too late, everybody. It's too late. We switched formation. <laughs> we need to defend instead. They're already over the bridge. It's too late for us. What we do, we will... Hopefully, are they going to charge or they got javelins like our guy? They got javelins. Okay. Defend, men. They've only got 23 infantry, so it's not that bad. My cavalry. Kill the enemy archers for me. We'll we're kill the infantry and the cavalry. Oh, there's a few for here. Wait. They've got really good armor on the head. Let's go for the chest instead. They've got two handed swords. I kind of want them to hit me so I can see what happens to me if I get whacked by one, but. We'll see, we'll see. Okay, let's just kill with what imagery for now. So I kind of want to start moving forward towards the archers as well. Guys, move up, move up. We're going in. There's so much cavalry. The problem's going to be, in a second, they're going to run out of javelins, right? And they're going to start this charging. So we want to be on the bridge at that point, or standing still at least, so we're not just overwhelmed. Stay back! Back, I say! Guys, push forward. You've got the advantage. There's only like four enemies. Kill them and walk past them. I'll do it myself. 19 damn These These guys seem stronger than the Romans. Their, their armor's in... What's their armor value? Like 200? No, that guy's not there. This guy's not got the power. Okay, we've reached... The point. Set up here. This is going to be the perfect no 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 cavalry location. Yeah, I've only got five archers anyway. I'll, go, I'll kill them myself. You guys do all the rest. Hey. I'm trying to get them and say... Wait, wait come... Okay, they're gone. They're gone. Don't worry about it. Okay, hold this bridge, men. We will zang fei the bridge. None shall pass anymore. The problem's going to be my cavalry is kind of just fighting their own little battles. I kind of want them to stay away from the enemy cavalry because I think there's this better arms. It's so annoying. There's still... Kill those three guys! <laughs> They're just shooting us! I can't have that. This guy is screwed. How is he gonna get out of it? Oh, he just turned around. Never mind. <laughs> How will he survive? Okay, we're smashing it so far. They have got quite a few kills, though, to be fair. Finish them. One more. Kill him. Okay. Stand here. Defend. Why is the shield so condensed? It's okay. As long as it's like generally in the area, if when they try and pass us, we just smash them in the face with a spear. It should be fine. Hold! Uh, guys, you realize you're maybe in a formation, right? They kind of just like, I refuse. Kill him. Okay, now we hold the bridge. They eventually keep charging us and we kill them one by one. It should be glorious, everybody. Truly glorious. I'll try and kill as many as I can myself here. I don't even know how that killed that guy. I hit him with the stick. He's like, ah, oh, the power of the stick. It's covered in splinters, so it's uh, pretty dangerous. Nice. Uh oh, wait, let's talk about this. Oh my god, he just got destroyed. Okay, how many got left? We've got 30 enemies left here. That was a great kill, actually. I love that one. Okay, I need to figure out a way of, like, where are my units at? Come over this way. Go to that other side of the bridge. They're going to slowly kill me with just charging into me, doing, like, 10 damage at a time. I'd rather avoid that if I can. Oh, oh, luckily he missed. Is he going to get another horse? Yes, he is. Cavalry! Fire at woman! Okay, so the plan's going to be... Oh, they're running away! Oh, we don't. Victory! The bridge was held. 17 renown. Wow, their scouts did a ton of kills. They're actually pretty powerful. Um, where are ours at? Ours did okay. We, we held our own. I got a lot of units at this point, like different types. They're absolutely all over the place. Cool.
That's kind of scary, though, they had that many. If that was, like, an open battlefield, it might have been a bit different. If they actually threw 85 javelins, or, what, four each? That's a lot of javelins. And then they started doing just, like, attacks over and over again, we probably would have been in big trouble. Though, luckily, they had no infantry. If I was stuck fighting infantry versus infantry, and then the cavalry attacked from behind, that would have been really, really bad. Uh, you're free to go, though, buddy. Elite scouts. How good are they compared to our guys? So they have massive helmet and body armor on the helmet. So 25. Another 35. So it's 60. What? 60? My guys have a shirt on. Okay, so they might be better than us. Who cares, everybody? We still defeated them today. They may have more armor. I feel like these guys are tanky as well, right? 50, 65, 75. What? Oh, what is this? Okay, so they, they may have better infantry thus than us. They may have better cavalry than us. But do they have... Um, I've got to try and think of something here. Do they, have a, they haven't got a spear. So their problem is, they have superior armor, but because they're not using the thrusting abilities, they're probably not going to be as strong in that regard. Though it doesn't really affect the cavalry. The cavalry are just better. Simple as that. Um, what are the archers like anyway? I'm kind of curious. 120 pound bow, 100 piercing damage. What, what even is our archer? I don't even looked at them. Uh, where are the archers at? Archer. Oh, same. I think it's very similar. Cool. Well, okay, anyway, so let's upgrade the people that survive. The survivors. We'll keep these guys prison. I might be able to recruit them. Because, of course, they are, in fact, not Roman. So it shouldn't be too much of a problem. Wow, look at this super ha harness. Uh, wait, I'm going to pick that up. Oh, we got, we got three of them. I found three, four legendary harnesses on one battle. That's pretty crazy. Uh, okay, I guess I'm happy with that. So we'll keep an eye out of their armor then. So if I find some of their legendary armor, I can actually get an upgrade on my chest piece, which would be pretty badass. Capacity succeed. Oh, I think I'm like way over stuff here. Let me go back to base and sell some stuff here. Don't mind me, friend. I have way too much junk in my trunk. Let's just get rid of this. Oh, I know what's happening. I haven't got enough because of the, um, the money is not enough on these places. So we probably want to do, in that case... First off, let me just double check, because it's always the same thing. It's normally green is normally the problem here. But I'm pretty sure I, I now mark green as do not keep, because it keeps just filling up all my inventory. So <laughs> get rid of the green. We don't need it anymore. It's fine. We probably should make sure we've got a good selection of food, though. Okay, we, we have no cheese at all. We'll buy some cheese. We've got loads of fish, right? Loads of fish. Butter. No butter. Buy the butter. Buy all these small quantity items as well. And I guess we can bulk sell some more random goods. Done. So what we can do with the rest of the stuff we have. Let me just look in here quickly. I can just dump it on the floor. And then my troops become more powerful using magnets. Just like this. Perfect. Oh, that's too much power. We do one at a time. Yes. Power. I probably should do this when I have more troops, though, because I've currently got a lot of gaps. So at least my allies are now moving towards enemy territory, so they're going to start the battles quite soon. If I just quickly run around and get some more troops again. I feel like this the the, uh, the battles are very deadly. Everyone's dying, like, en masse, which is pretty cool. No, 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 not Romans. Anyone but Romans. Yeah, I feel like everyone's dying en masse, which is pretty awesome to see. Um, it means things are just a lot more deadly. What are you doing? He doesn't seem to be doing anything. Let's have a quick look at him. Something suspicious is going on, in my opinion. He's not working as he was working the last time I played this mod set. Unless, did he die and get respawned, perhaps? Problems, I can't even see where he's on the map. He might be somewhere, I'm not really sure. Uh, let's get rid of these guys. 187 troops is crazy, by the way. We're not even clan rank 3 yet. It's, it's absolutely insane how quick we're going to go up in the things here. Look at these giant guard parties that are existing right now. It's pretty crazy. 
I wonder if like some like really rich or capital cities might have like two or three hundred guard parties. That'd be pretty awesome. Uh, done. I got enough troops. Let's go back to the dumping grounds. Get rid of our stuff. Take it all. And just like that, we've got another 35 level ups. Excellent. Okay. I should have a pretty high levelish kind of army at this point. It should be pretty powerful. Okay, let me just double check. Before we go back into the fray, you are broken. Why are you broken? Did I make a mistake somehow? So maybe we're recruiting Batap. Oh, that's correct. That's correct, isn't it? That's what he should be getting. But he doesn't seem to have the ability to recruit Britons too. I think it might be because he can't hire any inventory at all. No, I'm confused because this worked before. I used to use... Where is it? More options. Allow troop conversions. He doesn't seem to be recruiting anybody. Yeah, super confusing. Okay, what we're going to do... Let's change up a little bit, shall we? 50%, 50%. Create template. Uh, Germanic. And what I'll do, I will put the Britons down. Actually, I think I kind of... Yeah, we put the Britons down. Tier. Ah, there they are. Okay, we put these guys down as a priority. And we'll also put down these guys again. Hopefully it works this time. So now it should, in theory be requesting to hire inventory and the cavalry. So hopefully he can convert them over as he starts recruiting troops. If not, I don't know how to fix him. He seems to be broken. So we'll just see how it goes. It definitely worked on the last series I did, so I'm not sure why it's not working this time. Where is he, by the way? Uborium. He's over there. Why is he not doing anything? Maybe he's just stuck. I really can't tell you. He doesn't seem to be functioning, though, unfortunately. Well, that's unfortunate. It is what it is, I guess. If not Nothing works all the time. This is how things are. Kill him. Okay, so I guess the question is, what's going on here? We've got, looks like we've got a siege over here we might try and join in with. Well, he's got enemies surrounding him, though. He's got two guard squads. We should try and kill them. Oh, wait! Grab my guy! Did I, I think I missed. No, I've only got the guards! We retreat a little bit, wait until they come up again, and we grab the guards because they seem super slow. Yes, go! Done it. I love guards. <laughs> it's a perfect way of catching your enemies, apparently. So, uh, now that's sorted out, let's upgrade our character before we go any further. Let's go for... Ooh, what do we want to pick here? I'm going to go for... Let's go for the... Let's go for the top one. Okay, I'm going to go for the A Corpse, and we're also going to pick enemy things so you can get more speed ups with the old levels. And I've got a new thing completely. I've got a new attribute point. So let's go for control, and we'll grab some more tactics. Or let's cap out medicine. Get more speed that way. Let's go. Let's do this. Ready up? Yeah! Ah, this is different than the last one. They have a massive amount of infantry. So I really do think they might have better armor because they haven't got thrusting weapons. We're going to absolutely smash them. I'm pretty certain. I got a lot of horse archers though. Oh, wait, what? No way! I full on stabbed them in the face! <laughs> I can't believe it. Cavalry, kill them! We're gonna go and attack the main formation. Move my inventory. Go, go, go! Do not throw your javelins. You have no chance of landing hits. Okay, the cavalry's gonna do its thing where they just run forward. Uh, the horse archers are going to retreat behind the inventory. You guys follow me. We're going to go around that flank. Okay, perfect. Men, stand still in this formation. Ready? Wait for it, wait for it. Throw your javelins, men. This did not work at all. <laughs> this was a failure of a policy. 
Also, I kind of forgot that the um, debuff from throwing on horseback is now based static instead of based of your movement speed. So that did not achieve anything. But we can now easily attack the enemy archers. So that's pretty handy. Hey, buddy. Oh, no, they're attacking the wrong enemy. Attack the inventory. Get him, guys. We seem to be having a lot of trouble with this, but we are okay. We are winning this. Not as well as we should be, though, to be fair. Hit with the sword! No damage. <laughs> Oh, let's talk about that. Wait, let's have a duel with big weapons. Yeah. Beautiful. Cut his legs off. Oh, I did it as well. <laughs> Wait, where did the third leg come from? What did I cut off there? I have many questions. Hit me with your sword. I want to see its damage. And seven. How about mine? Nine. The superior weapon of the two. They're running away. Stop them. Oof. Wait, why am I being ganged up on? Nice. Good job, good job. Kind of, I should be more careful with my units, apparently. The um, 200 Warriors did do pretty well there. They did do a lot of damage to us. But we still did win the end. Victory. Nice. Now, I was trying to think about it, because, like, of course, we have only spearmen, right? But the thing is, those spearmen are only going to uh, have a secondary weapon. So, in fact, they're going to be using them instead of the thrusting weapon. Which actually is not a good idea in this game, is it? Because you want to be using thrusting. So, would it actually be better to have an army of regular infantry instead of the noble units? It might be. Oh, oh no, I might be wrong there. Because these guys, of course, have this. Hmm. I don't know. I'm not, I'm not really sure, to be honest. It's a shame that it can't... There's not an option in the game to be like, Look, guys, use pole arms. Or use this weapon as your primary. Just so they don't switch out to other things. Because a lot of times you find a base game, you're being, chopped by, you're being attacked by cavalry. And my guys have got their little dagger out. I'm like, no, 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 my man. Use the pole arm. <laughs> what are they doing? We don't know. i right, change my mind on this. Done. Cool. That one okay. So, is this siege going to start in a second or are we going to dive in as well? I think what we'll do, we'll call it for today's episode anyway. Uh, the enemy fights very differently compared to the other guys. I need to figure out a good mix of my own units, so it might just be that Yeah, actually thinking about it, I didn't lose that many troops here. There is a massive shame that this is not working. I would love to know why. Um, what if I can get him to move to another part of the map or something? So he does not seem to want to do anything right now. Options... Yeah, he's just not working. How do we fix this guy, everybody? Patrol area. Go to... Oh my... Has it got the entire map? Oh, a search bar. Thank God for that. <laughs> Otherwise, I've been here forever. Where am I? Uh, Kaz. We'll go for Kaz. Okay, you need to move from your area. I think because he's trying to recruit from a location... With only Romans. Maybe that's why he's not functioning properly. Nah, he's broken. Okay, I'm going to go and fix him. What I'll do, everybody, the two episodes, I'm going to go over and fix my AI if we can. See if we can get him to function again. I'm also going to uh, just keep fighting these guys. We're trying probably keep to fighting the Romans. Because that did seem more fun for me anyway. Uh, and also, weirdly, we're better against Romans than we are against the Dacians. Which is uh, very confusing. But it is what it is, I guess. Apart from that, everybody, I hope that everyone has enjoyed this episode. As always, please like, subscribe, and comment below, and I will see you next time. Bye.